blast. Hi. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back. About time. Man, shut your bitch ass up. Um, today's been filled. Uh, okay, hold on. First, before I get into all that, um. <laughs> Chug. <laughs> oh man. Well, before all of that, actually, um, uh, congrats on Epic for getting first. You're a god of a gamer. I'm sorry. That's what your first moment of the stream that you got first for. I'm, I'm sorry. That's what that was. But you know, beggars can't be choosers. I guess. <laughs> oh. Hello, everyone. Blood jug. Blood jug. <laughs> Awful. Well, welcome in. We're back for more Bumwario. Who's ready for more Bumwario? Hell yeah. Do you guys think that Mario would like Red 40? Let me know. I saw something where, like, instead of Brat Summer, it's, it's Red 40's fall. And I'm like, I mean, I guess. <laughs> But we're back at it again. Um, so I think where we left off, um, last left off, Jesus Christ, on the last episode, TP Mario and the Thousand Flush Clock, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, I think the last place we left off, um, we were in Bougie Town, in Bougie Tid, if you will. So we're back at it again. How's everyone's day? Sorry it was a little bit late. Um, I was having pizza. I was having some pizza pretty good our new uh bgm and i's new uh life hack is getting extra mozzarella on their pizza and it's pretty good pretty good but yay it's saturday baby i'm the freaking lose it but how was your day what'd you do did you do anything fun I like how your Twitter post, Mario loves the red 40 picture of Duplis controlling Mario. I feel like it just made him look a little unhinged. You know, there's a little bit of like vapidness in his eyes. But welcome in. Had some cheesy broccoli potato soup. Yum. Home, big homemade hoagie. What the fuck? That sounds delicious. I want that. I'm making some chicken crack soup tomorrow. Can't wait. But welcome in everyone. Now that we're here, we'll purchase that birthday present for little Bob. Can you guys stop fighting? You need to love each other. We just got off this long ass train ride. Long ass your door. You wouldn't happen to have a train set for sale, would you? A gold one, perhaps? No. I think the fuck not, bitch. Hey, Nestor, I'm gonna get a train set. The coolest one ever invented. I could just have them buy me a real train, but maybe I'll save that for next year. Damn. He's trying to be, you know, trying to be conservative with what he asks for, I guess. Is there anything in here? Any secrets? Show me. I'm trying to think of fun things. Uh, BGM and I went shopping today. Um, pretty fun. It's funny because it was uh, for his birthday and I ended up getting more things than him. <laughs> Oh my god, it's the nerd! <laughs> yes, I am a nerd! The business people I'm waiting for haven't arrived yet, so I may do some sightseeing at Poshly Sanctum. <laughs> On the expense account, of course, as you, you have to ask by now. Yeah, man. Oh my god! Hey, can we. Mario would like to take you upstairs! <laughs> Welcome to my vacation home, you marvelous man. The train journey certainly was thrilling, hmm? Can I play your piano? I can! I'm really good at this. You know, we'd be able to get him birthday stuff too if we just put more than just half naked Miku figures on it. <laughs> I think it's funnier for the bit that way. Okay, bet. <laughs> he said, say less. Wayne. Penguin. 
I'd heard Moshley Heights was a quiet place, but there are lots of tourists, huh? Maybe I should just open up a store selling Shiver City souvenirs. Shitty souvenirs. See you later, pussy. I'm a lurk before I bust a nut. All right, man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um. Anyway, I don't know how to respond to that. <laughs> Uh, before you busted it? Because you busted it? Like, how do I? I don't know. Anyway. Welcome to you! Would you like to buy some fresh quality pasta? <laughs> Yay. Take it as a compliment to send to your VTuber parents. <laughs> I had the good jeans. I'm not even wearing pants. Don't buy it. Thank you. Wow, look at them, they're so cute. We are the Wandering Girls, the Traveling Sisters 3. We are staying in that luxury hotel. Gosh, the height sure is a place of the riches of the rich, huh? I don't belong here. Is this doing it for you? Ah! <laughs> oh, fantasy. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome to Whiskey's. Hope you enjoy your stay. I think you're going to see the Poshly Sanctum next. I love how they all front face at the same time. You girlies are so coordinated. You're so silly. Very mindful. Very demure. <laughs> Sorry, I'm normal. Yay. This place is really cute. I like all the I like all the flowers. Very cute. Penguin. <laughs> so lovely house, huh? Yeah, sure. Take your time and soak in all of its majesty. I built it with even the smallest details in mind, making every nook special. Oh not only the interior but the facade. What? Wow, facade life playthrough right now! Yeah, look around inside too. Is there a secret in here? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Is there something? Give me your secrets. I'm just like ruining everything. <laughs> I guess it's sort of fun to live here, but I can't eat snow cones or make little snowmen or go ice skating or any of the stuff I did in Shiver City, huh? I don't know what you, I don't know what you got till it's gone. I really fucked that up, but that's fine. Anyway, I'm leaving. What's back here? It was a very germacore sound I just made. Um, speaking of that, I saw a TikTok which made me giggle. Uh, someone decided to like like dub a couple of germa clips in uh, <laughs> in Japanese, and it really made me laugh. <laughs> they like did the entire um, the entire clip of him being like the meat grinder. You know what I mean? If you know, you know. Welcome, sir. This is the Royal Poshley Park Tower. We promise a comfortable stay in the lap of luxury, the pinnacle of poshness. A room for the night costs a mere 30 coins. Mm -hmm. Oh, I also have another funny story for you all. So I was playing a little bit. Um, I don't, but it sounds funny. <laughs> you know, the meat grinder bit. So I'm going to, it's not going to be as funny because I'm explaining it to you. But basically, if you don't know. Um, he was fighting this boss in, uh, Elden Ring, and the boss, like, would do, like, this one hit where it would, like, um, almost take all of his health, but he wouldn't die. Um, so his chat, like, he was arguing that he was dying each time, but his chat was trying to say it's, it doesn't completely kill you. To which then Jerma says in reply, it's the meat grinder, exactly. Um, he, he says, well, you know, if I threw you into a meat grinder and the only thing that came out was your eyeball, you're basically fucking dead. And everyone in the chat was like, you're gonna throw us in a meat grinder? I think those are my favorite kind of, uh, like, I think those are my favorite kind of jokes or stream moments where like the chat is kind of in on the joke too. 
I don't know. It's so funny to me. Like, you're going to throw us? <laughs> like, imagining, like, a stadium full of people being like, you're going to throw us in a meat grinder? <laughs> it's so funny to me. Monsieur le Lamoustache. Isn't the last the reception desk magnificent? That's a lady. It's the woofer face. It's so funny. <laughs> exactly. Just imagining like the chat completely flooded <laughs> with those woofer faces. I mean, if you stick your dick in a paper shredder, you can technically. What? How? I mean, sperm bank, I guess. Fuck it, sperm bank. Give a new meaning to spank bake, am I right? <laughs> anyway, I shall stay here every night till her heart is mine. I shall not tire. Well, that's good, because otherwise you'd be on a car. Anyway. Gotta go. <laughs> okay, that's enough stream for one night. Hey, you're the one who told me to come up here. I was just eating my pizza. <laughs> What's that? Why did why did it cinematically close in like that? It may not look like it, but I got pretty stressed out. Like really bad. Like, but walking barefoot on the grass like this makes you feel better. You betcha. Here to join me. Oh, we're gonna see Mario's grippers out live on stream. Okay. You make the schedule, you dumb bitch. Yeah. But this is like the the decision of Maddie last Sunday. You know, it's kind of hard to decide what I'm gonna be wanting to do a week from now. People ask me if I get tired of walking the same route every day. I say, no way, Jose. It's a bit different every day, you know? There are little shy guys in the tower, look. I'm not the same as I was yesterday. Neither are you. Even the town changes. You'll never see another day just like today. So treat each day like it is. Unique. Aw. That's special. You can just pick times and let the game or whatever be freeform. I used to do that, actually. Where I would, like, um, it'd be a surprise stream. And I'm like, it'll be a surprise stream at 8 o'clock because I don't know. It's a surprise to both you and me what I'm going to play that day. Partially <laughs> Heights is sure is nice and warm. Yeah, I really dig it here. Cold places make me things. Oh, poor guy. He is so chilly. I need a key. Oh, motherfucker, what's open? Gone traveling. Sanctum manager. Hi, Pimento. Oh, you know what I want to do next week? I... I want to do some Dark Tide. I've been wanting to play it again. I actually, funnily enough, was watching some clips with uh, BGM where we were playing Dark Tide together, and I thought those were so funny. I'm like, I gotta recreate that. He's gone traveling to my house. God damn it. <laughs> Hi, Ryan. Welcome in. Oh, talk about bad luck. What should we do? Ah, <laughs> oh, it is my dear Luigi. What are you doing at my doorstep, young fellow? <gasps> what? Yo, da yo. <laughs> All right, we'll see him at the airport. <laughs> uh, what? You live here? So you're the Sanctum Manager? I thought you were a detective. <laughs> well, yes. <laughs> well, yes. <laughs> truth is, that it, that is more like a hobby of mine, if the truth be told. <laughs> Look at Mario Big Pog. Oh. Mario Big Pog. But enough chatter, hmm? Shall we go inside? No. I know one. Well, there he is, that fucker! <gasps> no, the tangerine star! Fuck! Turn it into an emo. <laughs> Mario Pug. <laughs> You're one step too late. We have the crystal star. No! <gasps> Not if I have anything to say about it, bitch. Hey, don't leave without me! He's so silly. What? <laughs> Oh no, we're too late. We have to go after them. <laughs> Just one second there, Luigi. Exactly what is going on here? Sneak quickly. <gasps> Whoa! 
Can't believe you let a bunch of ghosts steal the star from you, you lame- What the fuck?! <laughs> Thank you, single, for 45 months. Jesus Christ, that's here. You're crazy. That means a lot to me. Thank you. Like this one or this one? Do you like this? Do you like that? <gasps> or do you like that? Oh. <laughs> the different- the different genders. <laughs> Just a second there, Luigi. Exactly what is going on here? Speak quickly. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm, yeah, it's quite rudimentary. So you were looking for the crystal star in the sink. Oh, 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 VS, very interesting. Well, no cause for worry. The crystal star is safe. Yes, quite safe. And I wish I could read. The stone are that are for the red herring a fake. <gasps> of course they're a fake. The real one is hidden somewhere in the sanctum to prevent such a, th a theft, even. However, as the location of the real crystal star, while well, a sanctum manager, I am, of course, prohibited from telling anyone. However, I do know where it is. Of that, you can be most certain. Yes, indeed. I think Mario thinks that you're fucking lying. Mario thinks that you're fucking lying. <laughs> Besides, I'm sure a junior detective like yourself could find it on your own. Now, Luigi, put to use all of that razor-sharp sleuthing skills I have taught you. Make me proud. Mario's going to do everything while you sit here, huh, motherfucker? I just don't like doing this fuck-ass game. <laughs> I'm kidding. Oh, um, so I have a fun story to tell everybody. I, uh, oh, look at this star that they conveniently placed down here. <laughs> Yahoo! Um, so I was playing Final Fantasy yesterday in the Chaos Crew Discord. Um, and, um, a few of the, a few of you who were there were very, uh, lucky. Blessed, even, to hear a very canon event that happened to me yesterday. I don't know what's up with me. And wasps? Hi, Pistol. Welcome in. I don't know why wasps want me so bad. What happened? <laughs> I don't know what happened. There was another fucking wasp. So I'm sitting there and I'm hanging out, you know, I'm playing Final Fantasy. I've been, I'm doing good, right? We're in like a dungeon, actually. Yeah, I'm a gamer. Yeah, I do Final Fantasy dungeons. Oh. Cause you're so sweet or a uh, sweet or whatever a wasp likes. <laughs> I fucking guess. But you know, I'm sitting here like I'm like la la la. I'm hitting my like buttons. What happened to your gun emote? Um, I I put it away. Do you want it back? I saw not a lot of people were using it. So I was hoping to Oh, I really fucked that up. <laughs> Oh man, I just nose dive the fuck out of that. That was embarrassing. Anyway, um, so I'm sitting here and we're at BGM and I are like playing a dungeon with two other people. And um, I'm sitting here hitting my buttons. I'm doing, I'm being good. I was going to use it to describe how you handled the loss. <laughs> that's fair. Um, I mean, I do, but that's just me. Okay. Listen, I'm a streamer of the people. I give the people what they want. I stream nothing but Mario for an entire fucking week. I'm trying to finish this, trying to finish this long ass door ass game. Um, so I'm, you know, back to the same story. Anyway, I can't fu fucking finish a story. Um, I think I'm the one that actually uses it. <laughs> it's okay. I appreciate it. But I'm playing the game and then I, you know, See, that's the thing that's fucked up about, like, these wasp sighting, right? Um, I, like, throughout the entire, like, there's, like, a couple, like, hours intermittently where, like, I see something out of the corner of my eye. And then, like, I assure myself that it's just my anxiety, right? Like, there's no way that there's another fucking wasp. Like, it, it couldn't be. Um, but then I'm sitting here and I look down at my keyboard and the wasp flies, like, right next to my hand as I'm playing. Like, literally right next to my hand, on my desk mat, like a little bit <laughs> after my microphone. And I'm like, see here. And I just like, I leap up from my chair and I start screaming. Even though I'm in the phone call, like I'm in like a Discord call in the Chaos Crew Discord. So this is basically your free ad that um, if you would like to hear these live moments as well, um, to make sure <laughs> that you also join the Chaos Crew Discord so you can join in. 
<laughs> and he witnessed the real canon event. Um, <laughs> we're in the middle of a dungeon, by the way, too. So I'm just like losing my mind, freaking the fuck out, <laughs> screaming. And like, I like run down and I go get the raid and I'm like telling, like, it's kind of funny. I go get a can of raid while we're in, I think it's a raid. I don't know. I, I don't play. I don't go here. Um, <laughs> so like I run down in my, um, where my setup is, I'm like up in a loft. So I have to like run down some stairs <laughs> and I'm like, there's a wasp. <laughs> and BGM's like locking in a meeting. He's like, all right, keep an eye on it. Tell me where it is. <laughs> oh, I got a present. Got the item. Um. <laughs> but then the wasp, that fucker, he tries to like hide underneath my keyboard because he's a little bitch. And BGM didn't want to like spray a fuck ton of rain on my keyboard. It's like all over, like, because I have like uh, a bunch of my like stream equipment up here too. Um my uh xlr for my microphone my uh stream deck and shit like that and he's like fuck i don't want to spray i don't want to spray raid on it like <laughs> so <laughs> eventually he like flew away and like bgm was fighting for his life because like the wasp like he sprayed it a little bit and then like it fell down like kind of like faltering and dying and it flew away like downstairs until eventually he him died but it was a very scary, it was a, it was a real like event that happened. I like completely, I forgot that I was in the discord call. I forgot that I was playing a game. I forgot I was streaming. I forgot where I was. They want me, they want me, they want me. But it was scary. No, leave me alone. But yeah, so um, there you go in case you would like to uh, experience that in the future in a discord call um, use that link and you too can experience <laughs> my next mind altering breakdown when there's a wasp that flies close to my hand man that shit was scary though and also to like further the trauma right of that night um hi adam <gasps> i have ouija clothes Adam's is very important. I have Ouija clothes. Yes! I am weed. Um. But. Damn, there's somewhere I was going. Yeah, to add, like, insult to, like, injury. Later that night, um, BGM and I were, like, hanging out in bed. Or, like, in the futon. Right. And, um, I'm, you know, just, like, chatting. La, la, la. And then all of a sudden, I see this giant, monstrous cockroach. Like, I don't know what was wrong with yesterday. There was like too many like terrifying bug incidents yesterday. Secret Luigi mode, I'm Luigi. Luigi, gimme. But it was awful. And BGM killed it with a shoe, but it was horrifying. <laughs> but anyway, that's what you missed yesterday. When I wasn't streaming yesterday, those are all like the, the fun events that happened to me. Too many bugs happened upon me. I got a crystal star. Your star power is now seven. Ooh, I learned the sh um the move showstopper. Wow, we completed a chapter. <laughs> New record. New record. <laughs> Mario found the six crystal star hidden craftily in the poshly height sanctum. Now only one crystal star remains. But our hero still does not know where Princess Peach is being held. Give me my princess, motherfucker. Where could the last crystal star be? And where is Princess Peach being held? <gasps> rah! Rah! <laughs> Sorry. Hoping this crystal star might yield answers, Mario and friends return to Pennington. But of course. Oh. I have to return? Okay. I was hoping that you'd put me back there so I didn't have to like go through all this shit. Oh! Whoa! The uh, the pillow back there kind of looks like um, you know, like the the butthole flower, the one like the I think raffle raffleasia, raffleasia. I don't know how the fuck you say that. 
the like the 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 poopy the poopy death flower. <laughs> You're really hurting that flower's feelings by calling it the poopy death flower. That's fucked up. I'm sorry. The twit longer is coming. At the dark blue, purple just looks so wrong. The blues are so creepy. I like them. What's wrong with them, huh? HP and attack are high, but they're just like ordinary blues otherwise. No, they're not. They're purple. Don't erase what makes them different. So just attack it like it's a normal boo. Get it before it turns invisible. With liberty and justice for all. I think that is the raffle. I didn't know how to say it. Raffalesia? Raffalesia? There's a really cool Miku song that... Um, I think it's Utsu. That's Utsu P? Why is Utsu P in? What the fuck? Why are they all indivisible with liberty and justice for all? This is fucked up. Can I bounce? Yeah. Bitch. Oh. I don't know why I thought that would work. But I didn't. But you didn't. But Utsu P has a song called Raphalesia and it is cool. Ow! Ooh, I'm doing better. Now you are normal, I can jump on you, bitch. Yeah. Motherfucker! <laughs> bitch! I got a fart. I, I don't wanna. I, wanna <laughs> I got a fart end clip. I got a fart mushroom. I don't want that. Invisible. Attacks will now miss. He don't miss. I have a little bit of gamers up today. Oh, I could tell you about something else today. I, um... How am I going to hit them? Can I hit them? What if... What if I am also in Bushi? This is bullshit. No, you can't get me either, motherfucker. Oh, it's probably gonna go through. So I'm going to defend, bitch. I had my uh, first pumpkin drink of the season today. Very basic bitch of me, I know. Um, and you know, this is probably very uninteresting, like stream. Yeah topic so i apologize um i tried my first pumpkin chai of the season which normally i really like and i usually try to get it with like um non-dairy milk because i'm quirky and also it hurts my tongue but um uh, leave me alone leave me alone leave me alone i got it with almond milk today and i don't know if i'm getting fucking old but it was like too sweet for me you know, like that, uh, what's that one fucking song called? That one hosier song? I thought that was funny. Hmm, so that's what that was. Oh, princess, nothing, nothing. Just talking to my brain. I'll do this to it. Congratulations, Luigi. Now I look like Luigi. That's me. You have found a real crystal star. So please feel free to take it. I have just put another fake one over here. Well, traveling with you has been rather hectic, I do admit, but rather fun as well. I'm sure you will have a long road ahead, princess. Princess. <laughs> but do not give up. <laughs> Never give up. Oh, um, other exciting news. I, uh, I got Fields of Mystria. Finally, I finally caved. Um, so if you see that on my schedule for next week, just, uh, understand, okay? I also got, um, there's this game that, like, Jerma played a while ago, right? And I realized I'm being influenced. But that's okay. I, um, it's called, like, no, um, I I'm trying to decide if I should, like, wait until you see it on the schedule, you know? So when you can be surprised. Or maybe not surprised. But I don't know why. Like, it's one of those, like, games that I feel like not a lot of people, not the lot of a people, um, I haven't seen a lot of people play it. I only saw Germa play it, and it was very interesting to me. So, I hope you like it. 
also was really intrigued by Papers, Please. And I don't know if that'd be something you guys would be interested in seeing me play. Or if you're just here for the fucking vibes, you know? Let's go back to Roguelite! Or apparently nutting to my voice, apparently. It's okay, chat member. I'm not gonna single you out or anything. <laughs> what is the matter with you idiots? Falling for a fake crystal star? That's asinine! Sorry, dude. I mean, sir? <laughs> so let me guess. This means Mario managed to get the real crystal star? Uh, I'm gonna say maybe. <laughs> this mustache menace has nearly every crystal star, now they were mine! I think I'd better or alter my plan a bit. Before you do, Sir Grotus, you better hit the gritty! You better do it for the vine! What is it, fool? <laughs> uh. What? Are you sure? Speak! Bark! No, no joke, dude. I mean, affirmative, sir, dude. That is a positive, sir. Treason! Treason! I'm a princess. Strange, isn't it about time for Tech to call me in? Maybe he's busy. Hope nothing bad happens to me. Oh, here we go. I have to go take a shower because I haven't done that in a while and I'm definitely not thinking about Princess Peach naked. Nobody will mind if I take a quick rinse. I just love her like little blush that she gets when she gets out of the shower. It's so cute. Ah, uh, hee hee. She's humming a little bit. It's so cute. How refreshing. I feel like a new princess. Wow, did someone did a thorough job cleaning on this? How did I get in here to clean when I've been in here this whole time? I mean, I guess it's not... You could have, like, multiple people in, like, a couple in a space, so... Hope nothing will go wrong. Tech, what do you want to do today? Princess Peach, I have... I have reached a conclusion. <gasps> no way. A conclusion? I have struggled with whether to obey orders or to speak to you. And I have also struggled with what I should believe. Tech, you don't sound right. What's going on with you? Princess Peach, please escape this place as quickly as possible. <gasps> oh, shit! Escape? Tech, what do you mean by that? I mean, why all of a sudden? Yes, I have concluded that you are bussin'. Oh, shit! <laughs> the data you have procured has been analyzed. Something terrible is... No, I will not say. But I have found out everything about Sir Grotus's plans. Hi, Winter, welcome in. Grotus's plans? You mean about conquering the world? You're about to see some scary shit happening. Yes, and among those plans was the reason why you're being held here. Ooh! The truth come out, does Peach is gay? According to the date. <gasps> no! No way! That's impossible! I don't believe it! Yes, everything is true. That is why you must escape from this place as soon as possible but how can i do that tech i mean i don't even have the slightest idea where i am i will not hide anything anymore no not from you you care me this robot won't me who won't me <laughs> i will tell you everything the place where you are currently imprisoned this is the moon <gasps> the moon you mean the moon that hangs up in the sky at night? That moon? Damn, how am I gonna get back to Earth? How am I gonna get back to Italy with Mario? Baba de Boopy. Italians aren't real. That is correct. 
but that's unbelievable. How in the world am I supposed to escape? Yeah, bitch, that's what I'm thinking. We're going to steal the moon! <laughs> in both size and magnitude! Victor! <laughs> I don't know why that guy makes me laugh. There is a way. You can escape. But you must follow my instructions exactly. But Tech, don't they know that, they help, that you help me? Won't you get in trouble? That is inconsequential. I would like you to be safe. That is all that matters. Tech. I am the base's computer. No one will know of your escape if I keep silent. Please do not worry about me. Escape. Escape as quickly as possible. Oh, but how? Okay, but bitch, how? I must inform Mario about all this before I go. This is no longer just my problem. Mario, get the fuck up here. Just hold AFK for a bit. It's okay. You gotta do what you gotta do. Don't feel like you gotta apologize. <gasps> hold it right there, Princess Peach. Eek! You! Uh oh. Tech, you miserable machine. We all know what you're up to, traitor. Sir Grotus, I. No! In my most paranoid moments, I never thought my own computer would betray me. Well, it doesn't really matter in the end, I suppose. Especially since it ends here. You monster! What are you planning to do with him? Mm, Gak. Nickelodeon. I'm showing my age. Only one thing to do with a malfunctioning computer. Cut the circuit and delete all the programs and data that caused the malfunction. <laughs> That's a VTuber's um, uninstalling VTuber studio. <laughs> Obviously, all data relating to Princess Peach must go as well. Hi, welcome in! Yes, we must be absolutely sure nothing like this is ever happens again. Tech is graduating! Oh, fuck! <laughs> no, I am... I am normal. There is no malfunction. That... exactly. Me explaining why I don't need to go to therapy? There is no nor... I am more normal! <laughs> there is no malfunction! <laughs> Pipe down, Tech. x knots at the same time, press the red buttons on Tech's sides. No! Don't do it! No! Mail. Send. Princess Peach, I... La... No! 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 Why do I have to see the light fading from his eyes? That's so sad! No! Bring him back! Deletion complete. Tech! He's fucking dead. Candlelight visual for Tech, real one. The light flickering in the wind, so sad. Ah! <laughs> I don't, how am I supposed to say Gak? Uh, too bad, Princess Peach. Tech is no longer with us. <laughs> no, you inhuman beast, how could you? <laughs> Princess Peach, just stop it. This is no time to be worrying about a computer. He was my friend! <laughs> He was my friend. We have now a very important role for you to play. Yes, very important. <gasps> no! <laughs> Gak. <laughs> you idiots, you could have just restarted the instance! <laughs> oh no, Bowser, tummy hurt. <laughs> Uh, I've got no crystal stars. I can't fight Princess Peach. Damn, he has no bitches. No stars. Twilight time was... Well, I wasn't exactly glorious. What's going on here? If this keeps up, Mario's gonna steal everything from my grasp, as usual. Your massiveness. I feel like if someone called me massiveness, I would be very upset. We did it. The Magikoopa Scouts found a suspicious underground chamber. It isn't even on any maps. 
Yeah, really suspicious. Something must be there. <laughs> Just like Mr. Krabs when he laughed. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> About time. Well done. This is where it all turns around for me. Definitely. Hammerbow's battalion is attempting to breach the chamber at the moment. The area is impenetrable. They're scrapping tooth and nail in there. No problem. Direct me there. I'll blast us through. I'm Bowser, baby. <laughs> I'm Bowser. I'm Jack Black Bowser. <gasps> Luigi? No! I wish Luigi was here. Oh shit! Ready to roll! Why does this music go so hard? Listen. Make a Mr. Crab sound bite? That's not a bad idea. <laughs> you know, Bowser jumping kind of sounds like Mr. Krabs laughing. I can hear it. But I thought it, it sounded different to me. Oh, a meat. I want a meat. Oh, big meat. Oh, f oh fuck. <laughs> I got too greedy. My big meat made me greedy. I hate when that happens. Let me at him. Winter, you started to sound a little bit like BGM. <laughs> oh no. I need my meat. Give me my meat. Bitch. Bitch. How am I supposed to get my meat like this? God damn it. Can't have shit in this world if I don't have meat. <laughs> what? Why are you why are you mad? What why are you hunting me for? Oh, I can flame people, I forgot. What if I just go really fast? Fire! Roar! I like that he just goes roar. Go, go. Go, go, gadget. Bitch. <gasps> Big meat. I'm even bigger. Yes. Hey, what? Oh, I just had to be patient. <laughs> Hello? This makes the small meat the big meat. Get out of here! No! Man, shit! <laughs> you forgot the meat earlier. Oh. Damn it, I missed the meat. Mystery meat. Goal! Well, I didn't know I was playing um Mario Soccer. Very funny joke. I did really well. Bowser hits the fucking gym. Incredible, Lord Bowser. Nothing stood in your way. You were, you couldn't be more super. Please, no problem. I feel right at home. But where are we now? We're in a Planet Fitness. What is just me? Look, Bowser. Lord, uh, the wall behind you. Bowser looking kind of sick. <laughs> oh. She bad though. She bad though. Hello, could it be? Oh yeah, Crystal Star Advantage Bowser. He doesn't know. Chad, does he know? Does he know? <laughs> At last we found one and now we'll make it ours. It's fake. <laughs> Freeze, chumps. <laughs> Rah, who's there? <gasps> Don't tell me you knew about the famous rock hook. Huh? You little punk weasel, you forgot these muscles? You forgot this hugeness? Don't ask me how, but you cleared my secret training facility not too shabby. I even imported some super freaks on the difficulty level. Super freak. Super freak. Ow. 
course, no good. Don't count on this biz, babe. My chip belt is mine. <laughs> no! <laughs> Look, what an adorable little weakling I fella. You forgot my massive cock. <laughs> I mean, he literally like a chicken, so... Weak, wait, what? <laughs> Tell me something, you have seen a weakling do this? Oh, shit! <laughs> He kicked the fuck out of an old lady! Pain. Out. I hope the crystal star breaks. Oh, now you're sleeping. I knew you were a weakling. Yay! Well, the crystal star? I split it too! Oh, no, no, no! Wait, hold the phone. My lady to a Bowser. This is just glass. It's flim flam, a fake. What are you saying? Use words I know. Uh, oh, the real one? Great. Gonzalez has it. Oh, my aching hair. Feel the rock. And then he dies. Oh. <laughs> I don't know anybody named Gonzalez. Stop speaking in riddles, you chicken nugget. Damn. You're an idiot sandwich. Crud. Who do I have to flatten to get a crystal star? Who? Who? He's mad. He's mad. It's me. I am the one that has all the crystal stars. It's me. I think this is our last crystal star. Can you believe it? After all these years. Hi, people. Welcome in. I'm Mario. Oh. <laughs> My train, the favorite part of the game. <laughs> we just left the train section. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> You're like, oh, look, my favorite. No. <laughs> Mario, that sounds like an email from Princess Peach. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Did any of you guys have a Game Boy SP? I had a silver one. Bods exist for a reason. Exactly. Mario, I know now where I'm being held. I'm on the moon. Oh. Yes. The moon that floats in outer space. Spoilers. The moon! And I've learned something even more horrifying. In order to resurrect the monster spirit, they need my... Hmm. Hair. They need my peach. They need Princess Peach's peach. They need a big old juicy ass. The moon, like the one in space? <gasps> the moon for the moon! Dude, it's all coming together. I mean, that actually sounds pretty cool, but why is her email cut off? Oh my gosh. You don't think something happened to her, do you? Mario does not know, but Mario does not like the sound of it. You have a train ticket? Whoa, I'm gonna try to save up my money too. I know it won't be easy, but one day I'm gonna ride this Excess Express. I promise you that. Of course, even then, I'll never grow tired of gazing at this engine. Mario didn't have to pay for shit. Mario knows people. Mario has connections. Whoa! But guess what I found in Rattoris Ruins, bro? Yep, a marvelous compass piece. This part of my adventure was actually sort of sad, if you want to know the truth. It was pretty bizarre, bro. Want to hear what happened? It's a long story. Ugh. Ugh. Are you guys going to make me listen to him again? Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. After journeying deep through the Grimba Forest, I found the domed raptor's ruins. Inside, everything was pure white. I couldn't tell where the floor became walls. Don't be mean to Luigi. I would never be mean to Luigi. Do you think Luigi is making this stuff up? I mean, he has a little guy with him. How else would he get his little guy? Proceeding that ahead, I found myself in a chamber where a young boy sat. As I approached the boy, someone named Screamy appeared out of nowhere. Screamy said the boy's name was Cranberry and that he'd wake for a, a child of fate? What? That didn't make any sense to me, so I started searching quietly for the compass. Piece. Then it happened, bro. I got a tiny tickle in my nose and let out a huge sneeze. Well, Cranberry must have heard it because he opened his eyes right up. He looked at me and smiled, and all of a sudden I could understand his language. Whoa! I can go to the nearest alley and pay a guy $20 to follow me for a day. Bro, you have to follow me for a day. My Luigi voice is very bad. <laughs> Can you believe it? I learned that the boy was the last of an ancient race, the Lofts. <laughs> the 
have even been there guarding the marvelous compass piece for the last 10,000 years. He told me the compass was an item with the power to see the future. The ancient La Empire used the power to com of the compass to rule much of the world. Because of their greed, they were cursed by the compass and their empire collapsed. To prevent a repeat of their fate, Cranberry broke the compass into seven parts. He hid six and kept one of the Horcruxes, putting himself to sleep in a until a worthy hero could wake him. I was a hero, bro. He gave it to me, and he and the ruins vanished. And when I added that piece of the compass, it pointed to the far north, where the dreaded hate song tower stands. And this time, I heard Princess E. Claire's voice more clearly than ever before. I will rescue the princess. I will be super, and then I'll... I'll figure out the rest later. Anyway, I'm headed back here to root Power after that. I'm making my final preparations for my final battle now. That's what I'm doing! No way! I'm a little nervous, bro. But that's what I've been up to anyway. Wanna hear something else? No. You wanna hear what I've been up to, Fat Rip? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. That was really rude. I really love how the blimp looks back there. It's so cute. It's so cute. Don't I have? No, I don't want to talk to you. I was trying to look at my items. No, stop it. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Spin. Yeah, the fountain is spinning. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um. Uh huh. Ooh, I have pasta. Ooh, I wonder if um. Thank you for your apple. I wonder if Tasty could make something with the pasta. Book of me something with this. <laughs> Listen to this. I got the lowdown on a book that can turn anyone into a master chef. I went to the trouble center in the east part of town and recruited someone to find it. If you like helping folks out, you ought to swing by there. I'll reward you. So anyway, Mr. Brumblefoot. Book of me some pasta. Look at she's cooking up a storm. Oh, it's like pasta with sauce. Here comes the sauce. Ooh, spaghetti. I have two. Make me a more spaghetti. I wonder if she can do um do anything with the the dry mushroom. Sorry, I coughed. Hope I didn't cough directly in your ear. I'm trying to cough to the side. You have to wait now. Yay! When do you think the the next chapter of Poppy Playtime is coming out? I'm also trying to decide if I should play it because the last chapter kind of felt like dragon balls through glass, you know? Not that I have those, but you know, what I imagine would like feel or how that uh, feel, you know, fuck. <laughs> oh, unfortunately that did not turn out quite right, but hey, it happened. Go on, take it. I got a mistake. Oh boy! Oh. Not the first time I've seen that before. Goodbye. I love mistake. Yummy. I think mistake probably tastes like ketchup chicken. Somebody smells filthy rich. Don't tell me a guy dressed like you grew up in Parsley Heights. That's ridiculous. If you did, you'd better watch your back. There are more than a few thugs in town. <gasps> he knows where I just came from. <laughs> la 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 la. Ooh, 50 HP. I don't even have that much. What the fuck? I'm gonna buy more items. Because especially for like having like our boss battle soon, we should probably stock up. <laughs> it hurt. <laughs> or should I get maybe I should get like the big one the big one <laughs> you know what maybe I will get I will get big one you know what guys I will get big one 
I know you're not really arguing with me otherwise, so. Fuck it, I got the money. I almost got excited about Luigi. <laughs> no, I am Luigi. Look, I'm Luigi. That's me. But it's just Mario. <laughs> oh, it's just that fucker Mario. Whatever. Hi, zombie. I liked your new art that you posted today. Um, We have to go to the long time ass door. And I think Bowser's going to be here, so it's going to be a bitch of a time. Um, Okay. So we're fully healed. I'm a save. I love their style so much. It's really cool, right? I like it. I like my piece that I had done from the game. Good choice! Waha! We are zombie zombie! Wait, all the like, all all the stars are lit up, so they should all be here, right? Um, so the beach? Oh, that was okay. That was the beach. I thought I should be able to. <laughs> Bitch. Okay. Maybe not. Mario cannot do shit. And I'm back from AFK again. It's okay. Welcome back. Do what you gotta do. Okay, so I think I need to go through this way. I always have this every time I play, where I'm like, how do I get the long time? No! No! Fuck! Leave me alone. Don't throw your PlayStation symbols at me, you fucker. did what I gotta get done. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Sometimes I say hell yeah and I still think about Jenna Marbles. Miss her. I think I gotta go this way. Get fucking attacked by so- What the- Oh my god! <laughs> We're under fucking attack! Oh my god, it's Mika. Which bad do you want to trade for? Um, should I make it so Mario's attacks sound weird? Make more hearts appear? Ooh, that'd be nice. I don't even think I have enough badge points to... To... Get that. Uh. Chill out. Never succumb to a first strike. Oh, that'd be nice. I'm thinking about playing a a Sonic game in the in the winter. I think Mika said to play um, Sonic Adventure 2. Let me get this one. All right, I'm gonna see what the weird badge makes us sound like. Um. All right, are we ready to see? Sonic Adventure 2 is cracked, like bad, like slash negative or slash pause. <laughs> oh, this is where I find like the secrets that I fix and stuff. But I need to blow through this with bomb. Thank fuck it's the good 3D Sonic game. Yay, now I can walk through here. I think. Can I talk to you? You want to know what I'm doing down here, do you? <laughs> I'm down here looking for the legendary buried gold. That's what I'm doing. It's not like I'm unemployed and I have tons of time to kill. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> no, man. I, I wouldn't say anything like that. Maddie Adventure 2. Yeah. Howdy, my name's Wonky, and there's no stuff. I may not look like much, but I know a thing or two. You better believe it. And who knows? The stuff I may know may be even help stuff to help you. And so if you want to ask me a question, just speak up and ask away. Pay me five coins, and I suppose I can tell you about an incident I saw. Um, sure. I think Mika said not to play the one that's on Steam, though, because it was, like, sped up or something horrible. I don't know what's up with, like, uh... 
it's like the the chrono trigger on steam was crazy and then the uh <laughs> And then the um the, the Sonic Adventure 2 on Steam is crazy. Bayonetta on Steam is crazy. What's up with that? So I, I saw a really cute girl in a pink dress walking around town a while back. She's pretty enough to be a princess, I tell ya. She hung around town for a little while after buying something from that old lady. <laughs> Non-sarcastic thing. Bayonetta on Steam is fine. I had a weird time with it, but you know, I'm also stupid, so. You're like, nuh uh. <laughs> oh, I think for me, somehow, like the um, quick time indicators when I played, either it was like automatically turned off or I had turned them off. So it was very strange. But it could also, you know, be user error. It, it could completely be my fault. You're like, no, leave her alone. <laughs> then she got nabbed in the back alley by a bunch of suspicious guys in white suits. Pretty sure I'm the only person who saw that, though. I Oh, Wonky was scared. You could probably emulate the Dreamcast version. Oh, that could be fun. I just like, you know, with like the Sonic movie coming out, one. And also, I just want to, I want to be, in order to be like a true gamer, I feel like. I should play at least one Sonic game. So. Well, I guess it's either here or near there, and I probably should have spoken up before this now, so oops. So just knowing what's along the streets can be helpful sometimes. And that is that. If you need something else, just ask a wonky. Um, I don't know what to do with that information, so I'm going to leave. Bye bye What's over here? Ooh. Recover HP for a brief period. I want one of these. What is a gold bar for? What? What? Do I just want that just to say I have it? All right, I think Bowser's gonna be in the room next over, so. It's go time, baby! Yo, Eddie here, sports fan extraordinary. Wanna know about stylish moves? I already know, because I am stylish. If you do it right, the crowd will just go wild and have some attacks, have multiple ones. Each attack has a different timing on for stylish moves, but I'll share one with you. Try pressing A right when a bob. bob when Bobbery hits the ground after his bomb attack. Sound hard? Well, it ain't easy. That's why you gotta practice, yo. Bitch. It's locked. Oh, no. Oh. Coil? I don't know if I need to go up here, but... Nope. I do not. Sorry, Bobbery. Fun fact, the guy who made those, um, those something about blank series animated like Mario 64 and Zelda did one for Shadow officially sponsored by Sega. Oh, that's cool. It's always kind of cool when like um, creators have the opportunity to do like cool stuff like that. <gasps> oh, I got to get it. Oh, wait. Ow! Ow. You're mean. Maddie's sponsored by chat. Yeah, pretty much. I'm going to do bow. Hold fast. Perfect. He's so cool. Um, Sega knows how to roll with the culture, which is nice. It is cool. I don't think I needed to do all that, but that's okay. It looked cool. I thought there was like another game that they, um, that Sega had like Sonic fans make. Look at all the blues in the audience, so cute. 
I like when you hear them laugh and they go, <laughs> Sonic Mania. That game looks cool. More HP, motherfucker. Yahoo! I think BGM said I'm underleveled. Ooh, and I have. Wow. Ooh, what's over here? Open they take a look at sponsor development for Sonic Utopia. Ooh, what's this? What's Sonic Utopia? Flower saver. Decreases the flower your or flower points your partner uses. Ooh, that's cool. Boing. Just gonna climb my way out of here. I think I'm going the wrong way. No! <gasps> Bitch. I never remember where to go. I always get lost. Maddie, who be voiced by Chris Pratt? Mika, who be voiced by Chris Pratt? He's a voice by Chris Pratt. Be coin voiced by Chris Pratt. And Miggy Z voiced by Jack Black Steve. <laughs> I am Steve. Hey, Bones, welcome in. And BGM is voiced by BGM himself. No way. Wow. Full star studded cast out there. Oh, I fell. Thanks for your apple wing. Yum, yum. Um, so I could tell you about um something else funny. Uh, BGM and I. Ooh. Sorry, I got excited. No, don't throw your PlayStation symbols at me. Stop it. I really don't remember where I'm supposed to go. I think I just came from this pipe. I did. Fuck. So. BGM and I really love this um, yogurt soju. It's so good. It's especially delicious with um, Sprite. There's like something about it where it's like kind of like creamsicle flavored. It's so yummy. But our like local liquor store has been out of it for forever. So we, um, we found a website and we ordered, uh, <laughs> I think we ordered like 15 bottles of yogurt soju. <laughs> I really don't remember how to get back there. Why 15 bottles? Because our like store has been out for like, I think it's been like months now and we're impatient. And so we have to stockpile because we don't know when the great drought is going to happen again. You know what I mean? But let's see where this leads us. Oh my god, my life flashed before my eyes. Oh my god, my god, my god. So I'll let you know how that goes once we receive our 15 fucking bottles of yogurt soju. It was a very important purchase. I think this is finally the right place. Sonic Utopia is a translation of 2D Sonic gameplay into a 3D game. Oh, cool. Speed, momentum, freeform movement in open levels, not like most 3D Sonics where you're on a track. Feels super nice. Ooh, okay. There's only one zone you never continue. No. Look, we made it. Only one more after this. Or I guess this upcoming chapter will be like our like our last star to get, and then we'll be in the end game. Mario is pogging. Wow, map is looking pretty finished. Oh, that looks 
looks nice. The moon. The seven dragon ball. I mean, the seven crowd symbols. Uh, stars. Fuck! <laughs> There's too many of them. You're right. Location of a crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. Hey, what's this, Walter Bash? Tell me, old boy. Does that say the last crystal star is... No. Seems awfully unlikely. Uh-huh. What has been your favorite chapter so far? Um, hmm. I really thought, like, the pirate, um, like, uh, I thought, why can't I remember his name? The pirate level was really fun. Chapter, what? Why can't I think of his name? The name of the guy. The name of the pirate. Also really like, um, Glitzville. Glitzville, Glitzville was a really fun chapter, too. What's your guys' favorite, if you've played before? Hmm. <laughs> if this map indicates it's true, the location of the final crystal star is the moon. <gasps> Cortez, thank you. He's really cool. The moon? Wait, gobbling. Princess Peach is there as well. This seems a bit off. Hmm, the problem here is how does one get to the moon? Quite a conundrum. Give me a moment to look into this. Excuse me, please. This shouldn't take long. This is my manual on how to get to the moon. He's my pirate cousin. Because <laughs> you're both bones. <laughs> you piss on it. Gotta push to the moon. Hmm, looking into this may take a little time, so come back in a bit, all right? Okay. Zip toad verified. What's up? Um, oh, I thought this was Les B. No, this is where we can, like, help people. I've done a few of them off stream. Oh, damn, we have so much more. Holy shit. I forgot the code in my briefcase. I'll be sacked for this for sure. Meet me in front of the hot dog stand in Glitzville. Uh. Oh my god, there's so many! Help my Danny! Another settlement needs your help. Oh shit. My skeleton brethren are like the Stig and his cousins. We have relatives in every country and theme. <laughs> You're like, we are the Bone Brothers. <laughs> Yummy gamer. Um. What if I don't want to go to the hot dog? Uh. Should I go? Let's go. I'm going to kill the cockroach first. Bitch. Never mind, bitch. <laughs> I kind of miss like the, the the girly giggle one. I kind of miss that one. Um, you know, let's go, Boshi. Speed run time. Ba -da. It's so funny. I feel like I went from I'm trying to think of like the longer RPG I played um, before this game. I think it was Mario RPG, wasn't it? So we've had a very Mario heavy year this year. Chrono Trigger? We did Mario RPG first. Dickman RPG? I want to go to Whitfield. Everything looks good. Yeah, better. I'm famous there. Mario RPG was so much fun. Whoa! Three years, gang. Holy shit. Thanks, Steven. That's so nice of you. Hope you're enjoying all of your ad free viewing and all that fun stuff. Welcome, welcome. Um, It's funny because I'm like thinking about... uh. 
So we did Prone to Trigger and then Mario RPG. And now we're playing this one. And I'm like, I kind of want to do Brothership, the Mario and Luigi Brothership. But I'm like, do I want another long ass Mario RPG game? <laughs> I feel like I need a break, but I say that every time and I get sucked in. Maddie Butcher versus Mika Homelander. Oh my God. <laughs> Are you the one that's having troubles with your your briefcase? Oh, this is no good. Don't want to solve my trouble. But, but I thought I was. I'm here. Am I dumb? I came all this way for you, man. Whatever. Wow. I'm getting out of this town. <laughs> Do you have briefcase? Oh. I thought he would have the briefcase. So Do I have to go look for the briefcase? I thought he needed help with his coat. Well. Shit. Well. I guess I wasn't really being really helpful. <laughs> I'm like, hey, I'm here. Do you need help? He's like, um, do you have the thing I lost? I haven't seen enough to know. It's okay. I don't know either. <laughs> I love the blimp. It's so cute. I really like in this game where they have a, uh, like the paper item, like flip, like directions. You know what I mean? Like. The blimp when it was like it turned like about face. I like that. It is silly. All right, go Bloshi, go. Go speed razor. Go keys are cute. Bum bum bum. Ba, ba, ba. La, 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 la. Are you done? Hey, I went like to one other place. Are you done? Ah, excellent timing. I finally have it, Mario. I found a way that might get you to the moon. You must first go to Far Outpost, and you must use the cannon there, and it will blast you. Holy shit! Well, we're using a cannon to blast ourselves to the moon? Yeah, extreme! I know how it sounds, really. To be honest, I'm not entirely sure of all the details. Accounts from far outposts speak of a device that can launch anything anywhere. Even the moon! To the moon! This is gonna be cool. Just point the way. Where is this far outpost? I believe there's a pipe to far outpost somewhere beneath Rogueport. But I'm not sure of the exact location. Yes, I believe it was hidden for some reason. If my information is correct, you need something called an ultra hammer to get it. An ultra hammer? Do I have that? Wait, why are we going to the moon if we have a cannon? Can we just shoot down the moon and bring it to us? Damn. You know what, Doom? Your brain is huge. Yes, apparently the ultra hammer is made for an opening. Apparently the ultra hammer made for opening the... What? The ultra hammer made for opening the way is here in... Ro oh. I'm like, huh? What? That was not computing in my brain. You have to figure out how you're going to find it, though, because I don't know. <laughs> you're like, I don't know. Good luck with that. Thanks. I really hate traveling. Bar outpost charge. Oh yes, one more thing you should be aware of. The bar bombs who live there are sort of a are sort of a surly bunch. They may not let you use your cannon. You may have to negotiate. With them. In any case, that's your problem. Good luck. Get the last crystal stone. He's like, anyway, whatever. Atomic boo on it that you added to your catalog. La 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 la. So have to find out a, the way to get the ultra hammer? But how do I do that? Um. Is it that up there? Her. Um, but how do I- Oh, wait! 
I can head bash it. I can bump it, twist it, pull it, bop it. Right? Oh yeah, I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Oh, hell yeah. The camera is ultra. Flash ultra. Oh, it's me, Codette again. Nice to see you again. Way to find the ultra hammer. Now your hammer will have even more attack power. And you can use a new hammer technique. Let's practice it right away. It's just like the super hammer. So no problem. Just hold B and rotate till your body gets all twisty. Try to release B to use your ultra hammer. Remember to twist a lot before releasing. Here we go. Whoa. Big swang. Big swang. Way to go. You got it. Uh, yep. You've mastered the Ultra Hammer. I did it. Goodbye. Use your Ultra Hammer, you can break blocks made out of stuff like this. Swing it like normal to break smaller stuff, but use the smart that I told you to break bigger things, okay? Bling, bling, bling. Have you Ultra Hammered an enemy yet? I... I think I used... Like, there was one, like, below this one right the the mid hammer and i have done that like the hammer swing but i don't think i've done with the ultra hammer super hammer yes <laughs> i couldn't remember it was like hammer then slightly okay or hammer <laughs> um this is kind of sad this is the last time i've seen you mario definitely say princess peach okay and be careful on your quest La, 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 la. Okay, I have it. Now, how do I get to the rocket? Ayo, hey, four eyes. <laughs> Look at this. Look at me. If you got an ultra hammer, use it to find the pipe to far outpost. The last crystal star is so close. The end is near. Um, I wonder if it's in. Because there was that one block. Like back here, you know, where it has like all the uh, the rooms of all the places we visited. I wonder. I wonder what's for dinner. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, wonder, wonder. I think it's back here. Oh! Guys, I'm finally having some flesh coke again. I'm very excited. I don't know why. It's like been out in all the grocery stores I've been to lately. We're in a flesh coke drought. Yay! Damn. Oh. Ooh. Yippee! Not really what I wanted, but we take that. Vending machine at my work still sells flesh coke. I'm jealous. Please have one in my memory. Like I'm dead. We're telling people I'm dead. Um, two for 75 cents. Wow. Thing. How do I... Two for 75 cents? Wow, what a fucking steal! Hold on, sorry, that just like set in for a second. I'm like, wait a minute. Uh... It's the wrong place. Welcome to the underground. Show us your ball. Anyone watch the Robots movie? That was like the one movie, like, hey, don't uh, arrest me for this. That was like the first movie that my parents, <laughs> we like pirated, like one of our friends, like a, like a long time ago, like one of our neighborhood friends, like helped us pirate it, pirate it. And 
<laughs> it's like one of those movies that like, I don't know. I just expected like to be the only person that's ever watched it or consumed it. Aunt Fanny. I'm just thinking about like the big bird underground. That one song, you know? I'm doing a really bad job of explaining it. What's in here? <gasps> Ooh. Hehehe, <laughs> welcome to Chet Rippo's Adjustment House. This is where you come to adjust your stats or your partner's ranks. If you want some adjustment done, talk to me from the other side of the table. Oh. And I can adjust those things for the low price of 39 coins? What does this do? What? It's supposed to be one, but the company that owns it never bothered fixing it. It's, it's just flesh coke too. Oh, so you only get the <laughs> the BOGO flesh cokes. That's kind of funny. We talk about the robot movie that promotes small businesses and re recommends ruining corporations. I think so, where it's like, um, upgrades, people upgrades. <laughs> Adjust Mario stats. We good. Come again. I like your little like tangly angly dangles on the ceiling. That's pretty cool. I wanted to walk past this. Ah, uh. Goofy. Ah. Uh. Alright. Do you guys have a better way of getting around in here? Ow. I just hit my hand. I can never remember how to get to the door. Is it this? Oh no. Is it this pipe? Let's find out! Let's play Pipe Roulette, the, everyone's favorite game where I try to find out where the fuck I'm going. Me here? Maybe. Nope. Maybe on the other side. Ba -da -ba -da. Ba -a fuck! That was a very aggressive fuck. I apologize. Quick hammer. You know what I want to watch, actually? There is a movie with Kristen Stewart where she's like a, there's like a, it's a crime drama, a lesbian crime drama with bodybuilders, with bodybuild, bodybuilder lesbians. I don't know why that was such like a mouthful for me to say, but I'm like, I kind of want to watch that. But sometimes I feel like these movies where you like, you hear like a bunch about them and they're like kind of weird. You gotta like think about a good plate. Oh, <gasps> whoa. Welcome in. <laughs> Hi Raiders, welcome in! I um my name is Maddie, I'm a neon devil, and right now I'm talking about like um strange movies and we're playing some Paper Mario. How was karaoke? Peach out, thanks for the follow, I appreciate it. Welcome to Whiskies, hope you enjoy your stay. Drink water, welcome, you welcome. dehydrated bitch! You guys drinking water? Sorry, I'm like in all caps. You're oh, dead! Like, what oh. happened? <laughs> what what did what did what did they do to you? Tell me. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm literally dead. What do you want? Holy shit, you're crazy. <laughs> Mika's out here doing a karaoke list of like a full fucking EP. Insane behavior. Man, last time you did uh, karaoke, they had you do uh, Skyfall too. Quit torturing her. She's my friend. <laughs> you did a whole ass tour. <laughs> but welcome in. You guys came at actually like a really good time. Um... We are almost, or as soon as I find out where like the, the long time ass door is, I uh, we're gonna be en route to the final crystal star. As soon as I figure out where I'm going, cause I'm very lost. <laughs> well, welcome in everybody. I was just talking about how uh, I really wanna watch, I think it's Body of Evidence, I think Doom said. It's the bodybuilder lesbian crime movie. And I feel like, I don't know. Does anyone else feel like this? Like, I enjoy movies, right? Any cinephiles in chat? Um, I like weird movies. I like artsy movies. But I feel like you have to be in, like, the right 
I made the name up. Oh, you liar! Oh, you're making me look stupid! Fuck! Um, but I had to be like in a like a like specific like frame of mind to like watch like a, a weird movie like that, you know what I mean? Have fun lurking. Hi, Tuna. I enjoy sins very thoroughly. That's why you're here in the Devil's Channel. <laughs> Hello, welcome. I'm Merlay, underground. Cute as can be. A charming character. That's me. Lucky for you coming here. I grant good fortune. Have no fear. Could be a mystic power tell of days to come. War as well. For luck sits on my spell. Answer me these riddles three. <laughs> Fiddle dee dee. <laughs> um, are you ready for a taste of power? Sure, fuck me up. I'm having a good weekend. How about you? Do I want a cheap path, normal path, or special path? Um, I'm normal. I have to be in the mood to potentially get a headache for weird movies. Yeah, that's. I think that's a good way to say it, which is more often than you'd think, but still. Because it's actually, that reminds me of... um. There was one movie I like, you know, you like, it's a perfect weekend, right? It's like raining outside. You like sit down with your like your little popcorn, your little snacks. And you're like, all right, I'm going to watch something fucking weird. It was one of those weekends, right? The last time I did that for a weekend, I watched High on Life, which is a Robert Pattinson movie um, where it's like in space, which is funny because there's another new one coming out like right now, or I think um, by the director of Bong Joon-ho, I think. It looks really cool. I want to see it. But anyway, in this movie, it's called High on Life. And there's like this weird Robert Pattinson's there. And every, like he has a baby. Well, I mean, not Mpreg, but like <laughs> he's taking care of a baby. And there's like a sex box on this space station. And I was like sitting there eating my popcorn. Like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> and I just, I don't know if like, I'm ready. Like, I don't know if I would have been ready at the end of, like, a long work week to sit down and watch Robert Pattinson enter a sex box in a space station, you know? No, it's not it, Preg! It's not! <laughs> no! <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> no, it's not! No, uh. My prego. My ego. According to Google, the Kristen Stewart movie is called Love Lives Bleeding. Your title was pretty cool. But I want to watch that. I'm trying to decide if tonight's going to be the night or tomorrow. So, scratching my chin a little bit. My mystic power can make you smile. In battle, you can win with style. Even if nasty foes arrive, you'll be fine once, since my fortune will thrive. A sex box. Was it a sex box 360? I hear those... I hear... Those things get this thing called the Red Sea Ring of the Cock Ring of Death. <laughs> Hi, Matt. Welcome in. Almost a whole all year goofy all year. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. That means a lot to me. I hope you're enjoying your emotes and your ad free viewing, TM Sparkle Sparkle. You know, Robert Pattinson was in The Boy and the Heron? Yeah. And like the thing that's really um the thing that's interesting about that movie, too, is I feel like it kind of like opened the door to like Robert Pattinson voice acting. And I feel like in his newest movie, um, I think it's, fuck, I can't remember. The one where he's in a space station. Mickey 17, that's the name of it. It's the newer movie coming out. He's like doing a voice in that like movie too. And it sounds so cool. He's so good. He's very, I'm really happy that he broke out of the, the Edward box, you know? Cause I think that happened similarly to Daniel Radcliffe, you know, where he was only Harry Potter for forever. I'm so I'm going on a fucking tangent right now. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Damn, I had that wrong. I thought it was Sex Box One. You're entertaining in one place. Sex Box On. Xbox On. Goodbye. You just cast a spell on me. For the hex girls, and I'm gonna cast a spell on you. Also, I'm sorry, but thank you again, Mika, for the raid. If you're still out there somewhere in the ether, please make sure you rest and have tea if you're out there. I'm sorry they killed you. Your space is your area. Could be a sex box series X. What the fuck? Where is... Uh, I don't remember where how to get to the long time door. Where am I going? Uh, shit. 
Well, guys, this is the end of the game. I'm never going to find out, and we're only going to be here forever. So, I uh, hope you enjoy the company. Bitch. Ooh, that was Big Hammer. Big. One. Win! When are they coming out with Red 41? <laughs> the sequel. I don't know. But welcome in. Do you think it'll be yummier when it's like they have one more red in there? Maybe it's like Dr. Pepper, you know, where there's like 32 flavors. Have your son back. Yay. <laughs> My son. I miss the sex box in the GameCube. God damn it. <laughs> red 40, but it kills you. You just die. Isn't that what Red 40 already does? <laughs> How is this one any different? <laughs> oh fuck, we added one more red and that was too much. Too much red, we can't do it. And then I think maybe... I think... Wait, this is where I'm supposed to be. This is real, this is me. I'm exactly... Okay. My legs! Guys, I think we found it. I think we did it. Oh, I could have gone in the... Oh, wait. I need to go back through the door. No, the door! I can feel my face when I'm with you. Mario shoots the moon. Mario pieces on the moon. The door and the star piece pipe. Oh, it's like winter time. How cute. I consume too much red. That's how Mario gets red. It's stupid cold out here. I'm gonna piss on the moon! <laughs> Mario shoots the fucking moon because it's haunted. <laughs> Come on, Gonzalez, let's move. Far outpost should be just ahead up, I think. Ooh. This music is so intense. This is some like music to do dark rituals to. You know what, like, music I was listening to? It felt... It felt... It felt... It felt kind of Mika core. I was listening to... It was like three hours of dungeon synth. <laughs> and I'm like, Mika would like this. I think that's like... Yay! I think that's a good compliment to give friends. I've come to make an announcement. Shadow the Hedgehog is a bitch-ass motherfucker. Oh, this music is cool, too. Colors weave I don't know if this will really work, but we're gonna find out. Damn, he, like, flung around. <laughs> oh, I should have tattled on them. Oh. He's mad. I, it's funny how with all the games I have seen and played, there are two villainous moons. <laughs> the moon! Yeah, because I think, um, why life? Spidey, I appreciate you're having a fun time. I think, could you slow down on the, the all caps, please? Um, what am I gonna say? What am I gonna do? Uh, I completely lost my train of thought. Fuck. Oh yeah, was it Twilight? Oh my bad. It's okay. Thank you. Look, it's okay. I'm glad you're having fun. You're not. I'm not whacking your pee pee. It was just a simple request. <laughs> Thank you for listening. Um. Is it Twilight Princess where the moon's coming down and it looks scary as fuck? Is that the right is that the right game? I don't I've never played that game before. Majora's Mask. Shit. I never played that game. Oh, I look like an idiot. Oh. <laughs> no, now I look like a fake gamer. No. I need to play one of the, like, 
The only Zelda game I've ever played has been Breath of the Wild, so I feel like I gotta... <gasps> I did it! Oh, oh, I'm a gamer! Oh my god! Ah, ah. Sorry. I'm actually... There's an obvious moon from Majora's Mask in Rare from Fear and Hunger. You know, I've seen, like... I never... I know that Mika has played uh, Fear and Hunger before. Or I thought so? Or is it Flesh and Concrete? There's too many sentence games. <laughs> Let's go gambling! Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah. It's not Majora's Mask? Twilight Princess lets you turn into a wolf, though. So it is moon-coated. I think the reason why Twilight Princess is so, like, burned into my brain is because I had, like... You know that, like... <laughs> I I'm gonna... Hey, I'm gonna bare my soul to you, and you're not allowed to judge me, okay? You know that, like, that hot babysitter that used to, like, come over when you were younger? <gasps> oh! Um, I had, like, a hot babysitter who would bring over her Wii. <laughs> we all love Midna in this house. It's okay. <laughs> I mean, she is cute. Uh, but I don't know why. I just, like, I had, like, a hot babysitter, and she brought, would bring over her Wii, and she would play, like, Twilight Princess, and she would, like, have me, like, hold the nunchuck while she was, like, like doing the, the wolf howl. And I'm like, wow, <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> Vicky from Fairly Odd Parents. I don't know if people would like classify her as hot. I thought she was just kind of a bitch. <laughs> That's a frost piranha. It's a cool customer with strong ice power. Max HP is 10, attack is 5, and defense is 0. She's 15. <laughs> oh, I kind of feel bad for calling a, a 15 year old a bitch. Oops, my bad. <laughs> People like the teenage bitch attitude. That's true. I said something, speaking of, like, bitch. Um, I said something on Mika's channel where I said, like, I like women that are mean. A teen, like, you, what? Me? <laughs> wait, hold on. Oh, wait, no, I'm not the teenage bitch. I'm the one who likes it. Yes, got it. <laughs> I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm like, damn, have I been too mean? Oh, shit. <laughs> Still shouldn't be calling a 15-year-old hot unless you were 14, 15 years of age as well. Oh. Frozen breath attack can freeze us, so try to mobilize it first. It's weak against fire attacks, too, so use them as well. That said, don't even think about using ice attack. It'll absorb those. gonna bore them. Ooh, she's from a cartoon. Oh wait, hammer good or will that hurt me? Oh, I thought it was an item. Oh, damn it. I don't know why this sounds like the colors we have decided to Go Koopa. I dodge it too soon. Koopa, hardly know her. There was something I was about to say and I like completely lost my train of thought. Yeah! Look, I'm gonna get it again. I'm a gamer. Fuck. That would have been really cool. <laughs> um. What was I gonna say? Man, I completely lost my train of thought when we we're talking about like about Vicky being hot. Oh yeah, I was saying that I find like some like women who are bitchy kind of hot, and Mika was like, "Why do you want someone to be mean to you?" And I'm like, "There's some, there's a, an appeal to that, you know." I don't know why. Like there is specifically like one character for. Um, <laughs> What was I gonna say? I'm losing my mind, actually. Um, 
Like, there's one character from, uh, <laughs> uh, Honey, Honey Pop? I'll be mean to your hair is too shiny and cool. Take that. <gasps> I don't know what, like, um, there's a character from, like, um, Honey Pop where she's just kind of like a bitch. <laughs> and I'm like, wow. <laughs> but, you know, they could just be speaking about, like, me and my own. <laughs> just me, you know, talking from my own kind of special, like, brain of, or variety of flavor of fucked up. Leave me alone! Everyone wants me. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. What the fuck? There's so many of you! HP Plus! No, 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 no. Audrey from Honey Pop! That's exactly who I was talking about! How did you know? Hey, zombie, I can see your Wi-Fi network from here. Oh, shit. Too far. <laughs> so far outers, huh? I wonder where the cannon that shoots to the moon is. Well, let's get started by talking to the villagers. Mm. This thousand, you freak. <laughs> Freaky odd door. It pains so hurt. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome to Whiskey. Hope you enjoy your stay. This is the bomb village. The bluey. There's nothing here. The blomo. I guess you can <laughs> guess from my kablammy reserved demeanor that many bombs only opened up to other bombs. But what if I had this guy? Your bomb companion will understand. Caraco. Um. Okay, can you guys, like, here, I'm just gonna, like, push him over. Can you guys, like, just talk really quick? No! You, you, you stay over here, and, yeah, you guys, like, just, can you guys, like, just talk it out? Like, can you guys, you just talk it out. You, you guys, just go over here. Mario will be over here if you need me! Welcome to Fire Outpost. Whoa, that is quite a lip warmer you have. <laughs> Well, okay, now I give you my special mustache reviewing personality analysis. Ah, uh, mm, yes, yes, mm, yes, yes, I've got it now. Your bushy broom means that you are a stubborn and selfish man. <gasps> He's a Mario hater. What did Mario do? How did I know? I have a certain experience with mustaches like that, see? Do I need, like, do I need to shave? Do I need to turn into a bomb? Why do they hate me? No, it's rare for you, Baka. Baka? In far out folks, it all falls year round, ba bang. I like watching it shine in the glow of sunset. Ba bomber. Kablooey. Oh no, the girlies. I mean, I know the phrase is a hoe never gets cold, but like, put on a sweater, bitch. We are the Chili Wanderers, the Traveling Sisters 3. We came to Fort Outpost for that skiing and ice skating, but there's nothing here. It's cold, too cold. I told you we should have at least checked the guidebook before we came here. Oh. Here, this will warm you up. <laughs> Hello, Traveler. First time in Fort Outpost, Kablooey. What? Fort Outpost Cannon? Why? Well, I apologize for that. No, I just had distraction. It was nothing. Kapowie! Okay. Let me in! La 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 la. Oh, look at the cute little sculpture. Looks kind of like a spiel. I make big snow blobs today. Maybe I am big as him someday. Kapowie! <laughs> Do you like my really terrible Russian accent? <laughs> I do not want the melting to happen to me, Papam. <laughs> when she bomb on my arm till I blow. <laughs> Am I right, gamers? Snowman, igloos, boss, snow fights. Yes, all good, but snow gets boring sometimes. Shabam! Wait, how is this motherfucker here? Almost your the label stash. I have tried too many times to talk to the girl in the inn, but she kicked me out saying Cryoble. So now I must use the heat of my feelings for her to melt the snow. A chill! 
Damn, this guy is number one, like, simp. <laughs> Make body and mind better, yes. Welcome to in. Stay one night, it's only 15 coins. You like rest? Dude, how do you know? I do like rest. No way. Come back again. Um, actually, I do need that. Uh-huh. Me staring at the goth Gami Mommy's cooch. <laughs> oh, sometimes I don't need to read everything. You know, sometimes just because there's like a little bit of movement in the chat, I have a problem. Where like I see something out of the corner of my eye, and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna read that, and I really probably shouldn't. <laughs> Please enjoy a meal made by Sh Chef Zesty featuring local ingredients if you hunger. <gasps> Butter! Space food? I thought that was butter! <laughs> Exotic butters. Distraction pig. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Ooh, do you have a special item? Whoa! Oh, I don't have enough space. Zesty, aw, oh, Chef, stupid. <laughs> Yes, yes, welcome, welcome to the North Winds Mart. Um, um. Which one? Guess I'll, uh, guess I'll store my mistake, I guess. Not very fun, though. Hey, Spidey, how old are you? Yes. Your shooting star. Oh, wait, I can have one more. Um, ruin powder. I feel like I should get this because it's available to me. Okay. You stupid. No, I'm not. 21. 21! <laughs> oh shit. Oh, I just sat my big old fat ass on top of Bobbery. I feel so rude. That's a cute little house. 21. Can you do some for me? Looking at night sky makes me feel vastness of space. You ever feel the vastness of space? I know nothing, Shabooey. I know nothing about local canon lovingly nicknamed Big Bob. Shaboom! Hey, you look different than everyone else. <gasps> yes, what business do you have here? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What, a canon? No such thing as here. But it's right there. Now listen here, you're the mayor. How can an official like you lie that way? Old boy, I know I saw a cannon the whole last time I was here, so do not lie, sir. I do this any one time. Anyone ask how old I am? Hmm. You call yourself a bomb? I spit at you. <gasps> it's happening. You know rules. There is to be no mention of cannon to non. The bombs no mention. You must not allow it to be used for evil. Of course I know all that, you great blowhard. I thought he said bastard for a second. <laughs> Space is almost impossibly huge. It's kind of crazy. The infinite void. We must use a cannon to get to the moon, old boy. If we don't, sir, the world could end. <gasps> ah, world could end. Well, no, we cannot have that now. Still, we cannot use a cannon right now because of certain circumstances. Circumstances. You must have permission of Gold Bob to use cannon. He is the one who started whole blasting things to faraway places policy. Once he got rich, he let the business slide and does not start it up again. Also, General White was the one who devoted himself to operation of cannon. He was so depressed by losing the job, he took a cannon key and ran up to some settlement far, far away. Holy shit. Blowhard, yo! Oh, oh my god, my god. god! Yes, it is correct. If you want to use the cannon, you must find Gold Bob and General White. 
Very well then, we cannot give up now, old boy. Mario, the search is on. Let's go find those two bavons. Okay, I feel like I know where the gold one is. But I don't know about General White. It was General White in the library with the candlestick. Managed to pick the soundboard? I... I like have my like my regular sounds. I really need to go through and find some new ones. I think I need to like switch it up a little bit. You know? Thank you for reminding me though. <laughs> Stream pee pee. Oh shit. Well, once you find them, come back and talk to me. Okay, bye, I guess. I don't know where General White is. The Binky? What about Stream Port? <laughs> Silly. It's like a stream deck, but hooded. <laughs> oh no. No, leave me alone. Oh no. How'd you get out there? I'm sorry for my actions. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna run away. Fuck you. Get me out of here, motherfucker. I apologize for who I am as a person. Ah! No, I don't wanna. Ooh, what if I did? I'm gonna try this. Oh, was I too late? Oh, man. Bitch. Oh, just wait. We'll have another genital piercings incident soon. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> you know, just easy, whatever. Is it, you know, just the usual. Every streamer has this. Colors leave it here. Bitch. Oh, no. Mario, no, no. Leave Mario alone. Peril. Spidey, thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome to the Wispies. Hope you enjoy your stay. Um. 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 I'm gonna have a sweet breathe. That gives me enough reason to follow genital piercings? I mean, all right. I appreciate it. I Fast, fast as fuck, fast as fuck. No, not the fart, fuck! Yeah. Big money. Hell yeah. I need clue more. Just all the cursed shit all at once. think about right i'm like oh i wonder like what my like my chat like memes are what's the deep lore of the maddie channel and it's some unfortunate shit like that <laughs> oh no you motherfucker Ugh. why are you so mean to me i know my ass is fat but come on <laughs> Yay. Stop. 66.7 thousand. Ooh, what's that? The effect of the charm increased your coins threefold. Holy shit. I have big fucking money. You, us, and coin are the reason why the crew is called the Chaos Crew. <laughs> 
That is true. Oh, for the VIP. Y you know? You gotta be a ride or die. I'm a devil. So it's 66. I gotta know that you're a fan. Bitch. Bitch. Ow, okay. We didn't do as well that time, that's fine. La 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 la. Fuck in the back of lip. Please don't hurt me. Oh, yay. Ooh, give me help. Oh my god, I'm such a gamer. Ah. I'm gonna get him, I'm gonna get him, I'm gonna get him. When she blank on my blank tell <laughs> Thank you. I drink my oiter. Make sure you drink your water too, okay? Look at him, he's screaming and he's dizzy over there. Poor guy. I'ma get him. Bitch. Oh, by the way, everyone, we have a new emote here. Hope you like it. We have the new Maddie Hyper. Hope you like it. <laughs> I love having lots of money. Yay, money. Okay, so we gotta find... <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> I saw that and I'm like, I, I gotta have it. She must be mine. Guys, can I tell you something? So a while ago, I started like reading this book, right? Sort of reading this series, I guess is more accurate. Tear locked? <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I thought it wasn't tear locked. It shouldn't be. It should just be an animated emote. Oh no! <laughs> Fuck, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Went to a Halloween themed amusement park and saw a 3D clown face with his tongue on a wall. That sounds scary. Um. Oh, hey, this is the place um, to the scary town. No, 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 no. I think this way? To the surface. And then we gotta go back to Bougieville. It says there were tier one when I click on it. I was gonna say, like, I thought I... It shouldn't be. I didn't make it to where it was tier locked. Um. I nearly said me laying in front of the goth girl with her coochie. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, but what was I going to say? Fuck. I completely lost my train of thought. Shit. Um. What was your story, ma'am? I can't remember. <laughs> oh, so like I've been like starting to read this like, um, this book series, right? And I, I got like, it was a couple months ago. I like started, I started it i got halfway into the second book and i got bored i'm thinking about starting a new series <laughs> is it bad would you judge me you lost your train of thought and there's a train on the screen <gasps> oh <laughs> the jokes make themselves <laughs> but is it bad to like just completely shift between multi-reading. I fucking guess so. 
Um, I like. Oh, I really hope it's gonna like take like three days. I bet a buck Shigo had something to do with it. She's, I love her. Shigo. <laughs> but uh, probably not convenient. I just like, um. Hi Chaka, welcome in. I'm just really, I'm, I'm bored of the other story that I was reading, but it's been like a long enough break from when the time, like I last read it. So I'm like not super invested in the last story, you know? Chaka. <laughs> I just hear a BGM like screaming downstairs. I didn't even watch much Kim Possible. I just saw her and was like, that's my type. I want her to sit in my face. That's fair. Welcome to the fabulous Success Express, sir. We'll be traveling to Poshley Heights today. Oh, thank God. I don't have to wait like a whole entire three days. La 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 I'm trying to decide. But yeah, the um the other series I want to read is called Fourth Wing. So I can't redeem it myself. <laughs> Here, I got you. You know what, Chaka? Free help it just for you. I wish I could have a soupy. Today's meal will make your stomach shrivel in shame. <laughs> Love you, Chaka. <laughs> Why would I want my stomach to shrivel in shame? Like a raisin? Welcome. She's very cute. You are so beautiful. To me. Hey, what are you doing here? People see train enthusiasts as obsessive freaks. You know, kind of geeky. But I don't care at all. I really, really like it. Why should I care? You know what, King? Hell yeah. Like what you like and don't be afraid. Don't be afraid of anything. Let me out. Why are you still back here, dude? We still have some time before we get to Riverside Station, Mr. Mario. Why don't you get some nice rest in your room? You're staying in Cabin 5, Mr. Mario. Oh, thank God. Thank you for reminding me. Thanks, BGM. Sadly, must crash. Have a wonderful night. <laughs> Good night, Merc. Thanks for hanging out. <gasps> Whoa, Yoshi! Why do you look kind of weird? He's so cute! Ugh, why do I have to travel on for every work and get shook by every plane, train, and boat? He's so sassy. I should be at home with my new bride. I need to go back home. Oh, my lovely wife! This is BGM. <laughs> wife man coded. I'm gonna have a nice little nap in my bed. I think we might find the gold um, bomb and then maybe that'll be it for the stream. Oh, I can just choose to sleep until I get to the... Oh, wow, that's so nice. Look at the train! Bing bong! Attention all passengers, we will soon arrive at our final destination, Poshley Heights. Wait, I thought the motherfucker was still over here. Where did you go, bitch? Attention all passengers. Now arriving at Poshley Heights. Please watch your step and be sure to take all your belongings with you. I'm gonna take my bloshi. I'm taking my bloshi with 
Come on, the blousey. Ring. Ring ha. Ring ha. Bit. Um. That has to be him, right? Yay, I remembered right. He is gold. Help. Good day to you, Gonzalez. What can I do for you today? Oh. oh. What's that you say? You must use the cannon in Far Outpost to save the world? Yeah. Hmm? Well, that is a rather a pickle, isn't it? Very well, then. I certainly owe you a favor or two. Hmm? Yes, I should say. The truth is, I had hoped to resume my business with that cannon someday. But just between us, I had only stopped because the wife said she didn't like the noise. <laughs> Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so I'll need to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon. If a matter of money, I would just ask how would how much would you pay? Uh 64 coins. 64 coins, you must be underestimating the value of my services. I just can't say I abide to that. Why don't you come back later? Wait, I have to donate my entire fucking Is this like some like allegory where God's like, would you kill your son? No, but I'm not gonna make you do it, but like, would you actually? What? You'd pay every coin you have? All of them? You, uh, really? Yes. Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know what that means? You'll be left with zero coins, absolutely nothing? You know that, don't you? I mean, I fucking guess. I mean, think of it, man. Uh, you've spent all your coins, I mean, all of them. You would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. I mean, yeah, I guess. But hold on, I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the consequences. Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure? Um, I guess. You won't say just kidding later on or any sort of storm toolery like that? I can really take them all? Really? You're, you're really making me, like, second guess myself right here, right now. Well, all right then. Oh, give it back. Oh, no. Oh, please give it back. He robbed me. I've been fucking robbed. Okay, great. Oh, when I wasn't serious earlier, dear fellow, how could I take your money? Ha <laughs> ha. It's a shame, I suppose, but I'll return your money. Oh, thank fuck. <laughs> oh. No, so draw on my boy. Hey, now where is Gonzalez? I was so impressed with the way you offered up all your coins. Hey, um, where's General White? Okay. Well. Yes! Okay. And now... I don't know where General White would be. But at least let's, I guess, like, um... Go back to... Where we need to be, and then we'll end for now. Time to take a nice nap. Mario goes nighty night. Sweet dreams, Mario. Think about me, I'm in nine o, and that we ain't in yo. I skipped it. I'm sorry if you're really invested in seeing Toad yell at me. Damn, he's gonna yell at me again anyway. Please watch yourself and be careful of taking all your belongings. Come on, Yoshi, let's go. I mean, Bloshi. I don't know why, like, large Yoshi just kind of scared me. Especially in comparison to, like, my Yoshi that I have now. He looks frightening. I wonder what that Yoshi's doing. I wonder what his story is, you know? Nah, 
la 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 This is the right way to go. Oh, my God. Let's find out. Let's go gambling. Nope. I feel like I can never find what I'm looking for when I need it. <laughs> I'm, always, I'm going the wrong way. Let's go gambling. Hey, I found the long ass time door. That Yoshi fought in the Great War and became the decorated cavalry rider. Unfortunately, his boyfriend, Yoduardo, <laughs> left him when he was still deployed because a long distance coupled with the heat. Will he, won't he return? Proved to be too much. Damn. There's, there's levels to this shit. There's a lot of <laughs> the lore. Oh, that's convenient. I don't remember how to get to that room. Uh, fuck. Uh, is he here? Is he here? Help. All these rooms look the same in my blow shade. Uh, okay. Um, I think if we just go to like the main entrance. Then we can go to the left and from there. Yes. I took the longest fucking route possible. I'm assuming I need to go back and talk to the guy. Who's the guy? Like this way, right? I believe. Get up there, no. wants me dead what do, what if i do like big jump that didn't really work no fuck they're being big fucking meanies and i don't appreciate it you know what for that you're getting your pee pee thwacked what Are you gonna be too spiky? Oh. No. I refuse. And now I should be able to. Oh no, I fucked up. Oh shit. Oh, dang it. Hey, if I like try to like ground pound my ass on the solid ice cube, is it gonna hurt my ass? <gasps> no, it doesn't hurt my ass. Oh, thank God. My ass is stronger than ice. I live, bitch. 
Okay, I would just like... I would like to go up there. I would like... Can I, like, swing my way back there? <laughs> Do I have to, like, go all the way around? Surely there has to be another way! Koopa, get out of here, you fucker! You fucker! BGM made, um... Halloween cookies for me, and they are very good. They have Halloween sprinkles and M&Ms in them, and they are very yummy. Very yummy. Do you guys, like, have any, like, Halloween, um... Like, treats that you like to make in the fall? I think last year I tried to make... It was, like, um like sheet pan caramel apples and I kind of fucked up and I like accidentally like made the uh the caramel a little bit too gooey so everything like just stuck to the pan <laughs> but it was very good for like the like, couple apples that I was able to pry off the fucking pan the BGM is a great cook because of how creative and off the wall he is. He's very good at it. He is definitely the one who cooks in the relationship. <laughs> well, everyone, I think I am going to uh, put a pin in this for now, and we will continue on the next time that we play Paper Mario. So let's head over here, shall we? Toasted pumpkin speeds, and I brew my own Oktoberfest beer. That's so cool. Hi, Aaron. Welcome in, everyone. Well, I love pumpkin seeds. They're so good. Ice cream's so good. Yes, yes, yes. I'm very large. I didn't realize how large I was. Thanks for the stream. No problem. Thanks for being here. I hope you had a fun time. I had a lot of fun hanging out with you all. Madzilla, roar! <laughs> um, but if you're new here and you'd like to know when I'm streaming next, um, you can feel free to join the Chaos Crew Discord. It's a shared Discord with me, Mika Magica, Kizakune, Vcoins, and Migi ZVT. They're my friends. I stream with them very often. Um, we're planning some uh, collabs for October for Spooky Month, so that should be a lot of fun. I hope you guys are looking forward to that. Um, and I'll also be posting my, um, schedule for next week there, who, eventually, TM. Um, let me see here. Who can I send you to for now? I think I'd like to send you to... Send you guys over to Shrimpy, who's doing some firewalk. So that should be a fun way for you to spend your evening. But let me see here. Here's our raid messages. Feel free to decorate them with whatever emotes that you like. And I will see you all soon, okay?
All right, everybody, take care. Have a good evening, and I'll see you all next time, all right? Bye-bye! <laughs>